Echoes away, welcome to Big D Country. This is Prince DJ. We have some breaking news to uh uh to share with you. Uh as you know, me and the sheriff always been doing the uh WWE pay per views. And this is something that is important to us, uh, because we always uh cover WWE different pay per views to put, uh, make predictions. And so now, we all know that WWE was going to be sold. This was back in the early in the year. Um, and so, it wasn't Saudi Arabia that bought it. It wasn't another company. No. It is now the same company that uh, has uh, USC. And, you know, of course, um, Brock Lesnar fought in the USC and also... Uh, round uh, the married Ronda Rousey uh, also fought in the UFC as well. Well, now they're now part of the WWE. They're now so now now they're part of the same company, uh, meaning they're now part of TKO Holding. I had the official story. Matter of fact, Vince McMahon was with uh, T, uh, TKO Holding uh, in the New York Stock Exchange, opening the opening bell this morning. Uh, at the time of this recording of this podcast. So uh, let me read you part of the story, and I will be having it in the marquee. Um, it says that, hold on, get out of here. Okay, it says that USC, no, it says WWE, USC officially merged from TKA group, uh, formed TKA group, Vincent Mann loses majority, majority control. Once again, Vincent Mann Loses majority to control. Uh, this is from uh, BNR, the uh, Bleacher Report. This is from Bleacher Report. Uh, this is my source. Okay, so uh, Vince McMahon officially no longer holds majority control of WWE. Uh, Endeavor officially completed its majority stake purchase of the wrestling giant Tuesday. Uh, merged WWE with USD to create TKO Group Holding. Uh, shares in the company beginning trading on the New York Stock Exchange with the opening bell Tuesday, opening at the price of $102 per share. So if you are an investor, if you uh, if you like uh, buying stocks, there you go. You can now buy TKO Group Holding. Uh, Endeavor owns 51% of the newly formed company. McMahon owns 16.4% of TKO under the terms of the deal. Endeavor agreed to a deal to acquire a majority stake in WWE in April. Uh, the deal placed a $9.3 billion uh, valuation on the world's largest uh, professional wrestling company. As part of the deal, Endeavor agreed to spin off USC and create a $21 billion, uh, $21 billion combat sport B... B... He, month, something like that? Whatever it was that is. But anyway, I made a long shot on the nap one, but but anyway, uh, McMahon has owned a controlling state in WWE since purchasing the company from his father in 1982. The 78-year-old transformed the business, taking it from its regional base and turning it into a national phenomenon. The creation of the TKO marks an, an exciting new chapter for UFC and WWE as leaders in global sports and entertainment. Endeavor CEO Ariel, Ariel Emanuel said in a statement, uh, given their c- continued connectivity to the Endeavor network, we are confident in our ability to accelerate their respective, respective growth and unlock long-term sustainable value for shareholders with the uh, UFC and WWE under one roof. We will provide uh, un, un, uh, ver, 
for valued, for valued experience for more than a billion passionate fans worldwide. And then I'll just have the uh, I just have you uh, read the rest of the story. But anyway, this is just breaking news right about now. It's just just happened, and get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Anyway, so this has just happened uh, on today, on, on um, this morning, by the way. Uh, so, yeah, so my question is, I mean, it didn't have an effect on um, on payback. They, uh, From what I hear and what I hear when we did the uh, payback aftermath was a very good uh, pay-per-view. Uh, it's not affecting Raw, SmackDown, NXT. But NXT, but, but the only thing NXT, now they're bringing in the main roster, uh, especially what happened when Becky Lynch uh, won the women's t- title in a very good match, from what I heard. Uh, yeah, so uh, is NXT going to be no longer the developmental brand? There's going to be no longer the way where uh, the new talents will shine? It's now going to be... Another main roster? Is that going to be the case? So, what's going to happen? What's going to happen from here on out between Mania to Mania or SummerSlam to SummerSlam? Yeah, you get my point. You get the picture. So, once again, the big story is UFC, WWE officially merged. And it's now TKL Group. Uh, so, by the way, when I was in Denver... And I was at the iHeart party, and they had, like, two TVs at the, uh, the beer garden. So, I was just happened to watching a um, couple of good UFC matches before I headed back to my hotel, before the uh, craziness happened of the uh, almost got left and almost been stranded at, uh, at the other hotel where I wasn't staying at. So, yeah, I was watching the UFC match. So I was like, well, how do I get into UFC since now that WWE now uh, merged with uh, UFC now? So, yeah, but uh, every time I was trying to watch videos on how to get into UFC, I got sidetracked and got this happen and that happened. And, uh, well, you already know that I just moved to Galveston and stuff like that. So I'm still pretty much new on the island. But... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Before we get into uh, before we end the uh, the program, uh, but the after the after the news, it finally stormed. It finally stormed. Yeah, the rain came. Someone must have did a rain dance, and it finally happened. Uh, it was stormed off and on yesterday. Uh, more storms are expected for a few days, but that's okay because it's gonna break this dominant dominant uh heat that uh. That almost tried to kill me. Yeah. So it's really going to end the heat that uh, nearly tried to kill me. So at least that's good. But I still got to be stuck in Norris. But uh, yeah. Anyway. Oh, yay. So yeah. So, um, well, TKO, TKO crew. Congratulations. They're, they're now... Toward the biggest force in sports entertainment today now, I guess. So, is WWE still then, now, then, forever? Is that still going to hold true? Is that still going to hold true? Uh, will the TKA group will be shown on all shows? Are they going to show on Raw, SmackDown, NXT, and all the pay-per-views? Yeah, I'm going to have to ask the sheriff when we do our next pay-per-view uh, how he feels about the merger about the UFC and the uh, WWE. I'm going to ask them about that. So, Sheriff, if you're listening, uh, get ready. And I'm going to ask you about that uh, on the air when we do the, uh, the next pay-per-view. So, anyway, this is Prince DJ. We are, we are done, sir. We are done. <laughs> okay, okay. Anyway, uh, this is Prince DJ. We are out. <laughs>